explain us uh, this animation in the background? What is it for? Well, this animation is uh, used to train the dentist how to use our uh, Ephysio concept, which is a quite new concept, because we are talking about a part which is used to make the impression, the healing, and also the prosthetic part on the implant. So it's the same part which is used without any removal of the components, so we, will, we won't break the attach of the soft tissues to the, the prosthetic part. Mm -hmm. So this is very interesting and this experience helps us to make every step of the protocol uh, with the vision of the surgery and the different instruments you have to use. And How is changing right now with the education using 3D uh, system and uh, also some kind of vision in integrated reality? Well, there are different advantages. Uh, one of them is that um, you are in real conditions, as if you were in your own surgery yep. and uh, you are guided and nobody is uh, close to you explaining every step so uh, you can be alone with the system and understand exactly every step at the rhythm you need and you want and you can do one time, many times, so it's, uh, it's time saving. Because we know the problem that it's very difficult to find the patients with exact problems and repeat and repeat yeah, yeah. all the time. And in this system, we can produce uh, different sequences, different uh, short uh, sequences with different clinical cases. So we choose the major clinical cases we encounter in our uh, practice and um, we can reproduce the, the particular difficulties of these uh, different protocols and uh, have a progressive training from a very simple case to the hardest case. So that's very interesting. We believe in this tool because there could be many other applications. We can imagine any protocol uh, that we put on a movie and you are in the real conditions and you can discover the protocol and train and train. And also it could become combined with the 3D impressions, which is also another tool uh, helping for the training because you can reproduce a case in 3D and uh, you can make the protocol on something which is not the patient one time, two times. And I know that they already do that in uh, cardiology, for instance. So as we are involved a lot in training, because we have our own training center, we believe in these kind of tools and we are developing these a lot. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome.